Hello everyone, Trigon here. Welcome back to Planet Crafter. Don't forget, if you like this video, tickle that thumbs up button. And if you haven't already, please subscribe. So I was about to go head over to uh, the waterfall because I've heard we miss stuff over there. But I was thinking, um, just in case we need to, you know, haul loot back over here, maybe we should make that our first teleporter site because we can make the teleporter now. See, we'll need two super alloy rods. Do I have super alloy rods? Let's see. Oh, wait, yep, there we go, right there. There's two of them. Uh, I'm going to need more of those, that's for sure. Six pulsar quartz. Oh, yeah, the, uh, you know, those two pulsar quartz meteors that hit in the last episode. After all the rocks had despawned so we could actually see, I went back and gathered, and there was a ton of pulsar quartz. Enough that I've got now got four fusion reactors going, and uh, built something else that required that, too. I don't remember what it was now. What else do we need? Uh, zeolite and osmium. So we got plenty of both. Alright, let's get this first one built. right here uh, let's try to center it a bit there and now I'm gonna grab enough stuff to build us um, let's see I think I just need two no I think just one titanium and two iron okay so I should have enough to build this a, a, a two a two by shelter That'll, that'll get, let us put a teleporter inside of it and get, uh, give us enough stuff to uh, to also uh, um, put a storage box in there. If we need it. I don't know if we'll need it. Oh! Well, I didn't cause these to grow. <laughs> That's right, we had a shelter over here already. I forgot. So I don't need to build one. That's interesting that we've got trees here, though. Um growing on their own. We'll get rid of that. I think I'm going to have to deconstruct this. I think. Well, we'll try to put one back here. Oh, we also got the next tier. No, we can't. Okay. So let's deconstruct this. And then let's see. Where can I put this? Let's try right there. And then it still won't let me attach one back here. Uh, let's try it this way then. One right there. And right there. And then our door on here. I hate having to have that up like that, but and then we'll just put our teleporter right here. And like I said, we'll put a storage box in here too. Although we've got the teleporter, I don't know why we're gonna need it. I've got extra stuff. Let's stick that in there for right now. Okay, so as you can see, we can now come to here, and that will take us back to our base. That's the location of our base. All right, so... We've already been inside. Let's go around. That's really cool. I didn't realize this area would start growing its own trees. I don't remember it ever doing that before. I'm pretty sure we've been up here before. Yeah, I can see it right there. Boy, the last time I was here, and that was right before the current update, there was nothing back here. Because I came out here into this desert area just to look, and there was nothing here. Oh, something right here. It's going to be a long trip around to... Uh, our little base. I wish I uh, brought a power cell. Might have to do that. Oh, holy cow. This is already a maze. Can I get into this box? There we go. Don't really need some of that stuff.
Holy moly. Oh. Oh, what is this? This looks like some sort of a rec room sort of deal. Or a mess room. <laughs> Oh, I love the, the, it's like a veggie tube that it goes around. Yeah, I'll bet you these will open up once I get some power going in here. I don't know if there's anything left for us to get out of these uh, chips. Yeah, we can definitely use the new uh, pulsar quartz. We did get the recipe to make them, so I can make them now. It's just a matter of gathering up the raw materials for them. Here we do it on space. We're almost out. We can empty about one more box. This looks like a mess hall. And a worm. Yeah, I realize I don't need to delete these, but... Habit, can you say? Well, there's another staircase here. And we are full. Just gonna go up these stairs and see what's up here. More doors. And another area here. We got some tech stuff. This door looks like it should be either destructible or openable. One of the two. Oh, and what are these? Are these like hibernation capsules? Are they medical capsules? What? I think we're going to need to come back. I really was hoping I could, before we left, I think what I want to do is um, go ahead and take uh, all the stuff back to the base and then come down and see, and, and make ourselves a, a fusion power cell and then come back and see if I can... If I can get this thing powered. All right, let's take this stuff back. Uh, I'll make a fusion power cell and we'll be back in a second. Looks like the sun went down while we were uh, away doing that stuff. Would have been nice if I had the teleporter a little bit closer to this, but that's a much better place that'll allow me to jump over to this side of the map pretty easily instead of having to go around everything. We still have that base in the crater we haven't gone through. I don't know if they really need to go through that on camera. We did that a while back, but I sort of wanted to just in case. Not going to do it today, though. Because there's other stuff I want to get to today. Okay, let's go straight back because they're sort of getting the feeling that if there is a generator here, it's going to be in here somewhere. Holy cow. That was a lot of stuff in the way. There it is. Nothing on the terminal. Well, this actually takes three. Wow. Actually, you know what? Let's get rid of stuff I don't really need. I don't want those. I don't want that. We'll, we'll leave the stuff I don't really need. Um, I don't think I need those. Is this thing actually going to take three of those to power? It certainly does look like it. Oh, that's going to be a royal pain in the butt. I'll take the chip, even though we really don't need them. I'll take that. Take the rocket engines. I'm full up on these, so I don't need those. Same with fertilizer. I have more than I need. I'll take that. We 
well, shoot, that sort of sucks. I put one in here and it's not going to do us any good. And I really do not want to use up all of my uh, power cells or all of my uh, uh, pulsar quartz building these things. Ugh. I should have taken it right back out as soon as I realized it wasn't going to work. It was too late. It's locked in there now. All right. Well, we'll worry about that another time. Let's. So this is probably not open. Yep, it's not open. This we already went through. Yep. So. Yeah, I can't get to these other things until I do more. Do more work. Let's uh, get rid of that. Let's go ahead and go up here. I believe there was some stuff we missed up here because we didn't have room. Yeah, there was a crate back here. I'll take the zeolite, the rockets, that, and we'll leave the rest of it. All right, well, I guess what I'm going to have to do is... Uh, make two more power cells. Well, at least we got just about a full load out of this. Alright. Um, I can always make more make more of the uh, crystals if I need to, so let's do that. Okay, I got two more fusion power cells that wiped out our uh, pulsar quartz. Hopefully we'll get another storm soon. Because that really helped us out. Now let's go ahead and get these in here and get the power turned on. There we go. We've got power now. Okay, I don't need to do anything about that. We did not go this way. Let's check this out first. Or did we? Yeah, we did. We did go this way. Okay. And we left that because we didn't need it. Alright, let's check the... Whoops, I walked past the door. Let's check the upstairs first. Check this side. Can't believe that took three power cells. Yeah, now our doors are open. Speak of the devil. And I want those. I don't need any of that stuff. So good, because I wanted to do some other stuff today that was going to take fusion power cells, and I was going to be very annoyed if I had to actually construct all the power cells we needed. Hopefully this will be enough to get us through today. Okay. Nope, that cannot be de de deconstructed. This is just a storage room here, it looks like. Okay. Let's see... I'll take the osmium rod, and I'll take that. I don't think I need anything else out of there. Take those, I'll take the circuit board. Okay, that's good. We've got half our space left still. That's the one we already went in. Oh, and these aren't open. Uh, I bet you they're future expansion. We'll take those. Oh, this one's open. And this one. Take all of that, take the boom, I'll leave the rest of it. That's junk. What do we got in here? Oh, this looks interesting. Looks like some sort of a holographic workstation. And we are running out of room for this stuff. 
those, and we'll leave the rest of that. This reminds me of uh, the old game Traveler. They would have uh, uh, in the, I think in some of the artwork and in the floor plans for like the the survey ships, they would have a holographic table that was sort of like that with chairs around it, just like that. <laughs> All right, did we miss anything? I swear I already removed that. <laughs> I guess that is it. Yep. All right. I doubt I'm ever going to need any of that stuff, but if we do, I can always come back for it. How are we doing on space? We have none. All right. Time to go home and empty the stuff out again. And then there's one more thing here I want to check out. And then we need to get to building some stuff. This looks suspiciously ramp-like here. So we're on the back side. There's the wreck right over there. And I just fell off. <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, wait a minute. Wait a minute. What's this here? Oh, it just goes through to the other side. Okay. Oh yeah, definitely very suspiciously ramp-like. <laughs> so I'm guessing the spaceship that we just looted was the uh, was the uh, passenger liner that all those graves were from underneath the waterfall or behind the waterfall, I guess, as the case may be. Keep going up here. And I keep going up here. <laughs> That's not letting me get up any higher here. I'm getting stuck in the wall. Oh, it's, here's the ow, back side of the waterfall here. Oh, there we go. Uh, I'm just going to take the whole thing, even though I'll probably throw out, throw out some of it. I wanted to get up there, but I don't think there's a way to get up there. I think this was it, this little golden chest. We get, we get another trophy, golden effigy. Yay. Is that a drone? Sort of looks like a drone. Did get another golden flower. Nothing too fancy, but there we go. All right, now let's go get some building done. And we'll just go through right here. And we're back at our base. And what have I got here? Junk, 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 and more junk circuit board in there. I do not have any place to put this effigy thing yet. Put that in there. Um, plants. I don't really want to get rid of any of these. <laughs> um, let's put these extra plants in miscellaneous for right now. That's full. We'll put those in there. Put the aluminum in there. Zeolite in there. The uranium, or the, excuse me, super alloy in there. And those can go in there. I've got a bunch, but I don't need them right now. I did get the tier 2 gas extractors up. Uh, and they let you pick what you want to get. So I've got them set just getting methane for right now. Though we're pretty much stopped because this has been pretty efficient. We filled up on pretty much everything. <laughs> all our storage boxes are full and all of that. You can see I had to make another box over here for more rods. Because we just did not have enough room for all of them. 
All right, I think the next thing I need to do is we need to get a silk generator going. So one oxygen, one water, one zeolite, and three silkworms. One water, one oxygen, one zeolite, three silkworms. And we do have the silkworms, I have four. Let's go ahead and put him in here. We go. All right, so that's going to start making a silk, which we are going to need for our next stage. All right, so this is what I want to build next. Yeah, and we need three silk for this, I presume, for some sort of net. We're going to need two plastic, one super alloy, three silk. And then we can also build the aquarium. Uh, we can actually build this. Let's get another oxygen out. And super alloy, computer chip. And I think that was a tier two fertilizer, looks like. Whoa, we are definitely getting filled up on that too. And I guess we'll put that in here too. We've got all this room here, might as well make use of it. Holy moly, this thing's huge. And we can put two different fish eggs in here. But I think we're going to need to put this thing out in order to get fish eggs to begin with. I suspect that's how this works. That is great, though. I really like that. Alright, let's wait for some silk to get made. I realized while I was waiting on this that I pretty desperately needed more room, so I sort of shuffled things around, rearranged things, and expanded this by one row of uh, building sections. So that gave us, what, three times five, about well, 15 more boxes, which uh, I think is going to work out really well. I'll have to rearrange stuff. First off, let's go get our silk. Should be done by now. There we go, we got four. Uh, and what did we want to build next? Oh yes, the fish trap. Two plastic, one super alloy. So grab two plastic. And one super alloy. And let's see, where are we going to put this is the next question. What about, how about right here? Will this work? I just put it right here. Got a drink doing that. Okay, phytoplankton A. Hopefully that'll get us some phytoplankton. And let's go ahead and put the extra silk in our fabric box, because I don't really have any fabric right now. I've been too worried about making more fabric, that's why I hadn't bothered doing the silk farm yet. Alright, so now, once we get the phytoplankton made, we can come in here, we need tier two, uh, tier 3 mutagen, phytoplankton, and fertilizer to make that. So, uh, what I really want to do, and we're going to need to keep making plastic because I've used that up. Um, we do have some more room here. Let's do this. I want to get another uh, gas generator going. So let's go ahead and start this up. So I say, oops, one more of these. Is that right? Two more. Two more of these. Okay. And then zeolite here. Circuit board here. I'm going to have to figure out stuff all over again. Oh, I need one more zeolite. And get one more iridium rod. Zeolite, right there. Okay, so. Let's go ahead and we'll take this one and build it right back here in the corner. And 
this is going to be... Actually, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to do this. I'm going to take these out of here. And we'll make this... This one. And we'll just leave that running for now, even though we don't need them at this particular moment. And then this will be our nitrogen cartridges. And now we need another automated factory. That won't be too hard. And then super alloy. How many did I need? What did I need for this? Oh, I need a rod, not these. I do have some super alloy rods. Over here, I'll be able to move this back in there. That'll help. Okay. So then we'll stick this guy right here. Where is he? There it is. Okay, and you are going to make our tier 3. Yeah, because we need tier 3. We need sulfur, simple bacteria, and nitrogen. Okay, so that should be all the stuff we need for tier 3 right there. And you are going to also supply tier 3 mutagen. Where is it? There it is. Right there. Okay, and there's one. That's our first one. I do have some made that we've... Well, not made. Some that we found. So that should be good. Um, I'm going to need some other stuff. Uh, let's move seeds down here. Seeds one. Seeds two. Seeds and then last but not least that one Okay, so that's these freed up. And I didn't mean to take a screenshot. Dang it! I just want that erased. There we go. And that's fertilizer, fertilizer. Let's make this mutagen tier 3. This will be mutagen tier 2. will be demand. Oh, I don't have tier 2 yet, so I can't do anything with that. So that's future. This one, demand. Tier 3. Right there. There. So that will start piling up in there, and we can go ahead and take it out of... Where do I have it? Right here. Well, that's tier 2. Okay. So we don't have any tier 3. Okay, good. I'm glad I got it made. Got, got it going making it then. So we've got a little bit of tier 2. We don't have any tier 3. There, and this will automatically fill up as... In fact, I think they've already delivered some. <laughs> but it'll automatically fill up as we get going. How's this doing? we got two more. Um... Let's see. Nope, oh, wrong thing. Let's go check on our phytoplankton and see if we've got any. We do. Oh, we have phytoplankton B and C. A, B, and... Oh, we got all three. And this will be... This will be what? No, that's not what I want. Phytoplankton. Let's just do... Uh, 
plankton for now. Oh, that's not what I wanted. There we go. Okay. And what did we need for this? B. We need B. And fertilizer and mutagen tier 3. So we don't need A. We don't need the C. We need the B. And we'll take two mutagen tier 3. And I think we need two tier 1s. Oh, no, we need fertilizer, not tier ones. And it's already filled up on me. <laughs> uh, fertilizer, where am I going? There we go. Fertilizer. Okay, so that, that. Uh, no, not tier ones. Fertilizer. Okay, we got our first fish eggs being made. Okay, so... The first one here is done. Let's start this one going. Here we go. Now, we can put some fish eggs in here. And we've got fish. And this is creating 8 grams of animals per second. Alright, oh that's cool. So let's go look at this real quick. And see, yeah, look at all that animals. That is going up super fast. Wow. Okay, let's see here. Um, we did get the insect spreader rocket. We got the heater tier 5, which I'm going to make. We'll get a drill soon. I think once we get uh, the uh, tier 2 mutagen, we'll be able to do this. Where is... There it is. Tier 2 mutagen right here. And we've got a ways to go. We need to get more insects going, so I need to get some more insect rockets up. But that seems pretty good right there. The Aquarium Tier 2 we're quite a ways off from still. Look at here. More fish eggs. And they got a new butterfly larva here. And that's Butterfly Farm 2, Beehive 2... And then here we've got fish eggs, fish eggs, fish, fish display, fish farm. I wonder if we'll actually have fish in the water. That would be cool. Then we can make the seed lerma and make the common larva. I don't know why we want to make common larva. It's absolutely useless. <laughs> see if we can make all of that stuff. The tier 3 drill, we are slowly making our way to it. We need 13.33 Pascal. We're at 11.52. So, that is on its way. I'm thinking what we need is to make some more aquariums. We'll grab those. Make, we could put in two more aquariums. One right there, one right here. And that'll give us room for there goes our drones. And that'll give us room for more fish. Yeah, you see here, I just sort of lengthened this by one. And they gave us enough room to put another row of buildings on. This is all working as it should. Yep, that's making what it should make. All of this looks good. Presume that's doing its job. All right. All right. I think between episodes, I want to get um, the uh, tier five, what you call it? Heater. This guy here. Actually, let's go ahead and make one of these and we'll call it a day. Uh, did I move the rods out of here? No, I did not. I can actually get rid of that. Those in there. As I built a tier three, or not a tier three, I built the plants three. <laughs> I built a thing here for them. And fabric, I think, is still down here. Yep. Put that there. Okay, what do I need? 
three boom, three iridium, three uh, uranium. Wait, was that right? No, I don't need uranium. Three super alloy. And then three explosive powder. There we go. And this should easily replace all of our existing ones. Because we've got three of these right now, and they'll be generating... Well, 1,500 heat. And 100 pressure. Yeah, it'll be generating three times as much heat and almost three times as much pressure. Holy cow, wait a minute. Well, that's 360 energy. I thought that was 3,600 energy at first. 360 we can do. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to get more fish uh, things built and uh, generally just get all of this going. This right here, how big are you? You are very big. One might even say you are monstrously big. Um, yeah, so much so that I can't even place it. Okay, can I get this placed right here? Holy moly, this thing is huge. <clears throat> that thing is absolutely humongous. <laughs> All right. We got that thing going, though, that's uh, going to increase our heat. Not something we super needed. We don't need heat because we've already topped out that. Uh, I think we've also topped out the oxygen one. Uh, but we do need to keep developing. Well, really, I think we're in the last stage. It's done. Fish. We're slowly gaining towards amphibians, but I don't think it's going to make any difference. No. So for now, it's just opening this stuff up. And the only thing we need really is pressure. And then we need to work on plants, insects, and animals in order to get the rest of this stuff opened up. But that's going to be it for today, guys. I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you have, please remember to tickle that thumbs up button. If you haven't already, please subscribe. And we'll see you next time. Have a great day.